much of a big tackle for loss. What was that play like and how did that go? Yeah, it was a play we've been working all week, you know, just read it, you know, stayed true to my, true to my keys and, you know, I just did the play, you know, when the moment came, I was ready. What did that sound feel like? Is it not the sound of the hit, <laughs> the sound of the crowd, the sound of the crowd when you made that, that play? Nothing like it. There's nothing like it. You know, Sooner fans are unreal. You know, that moment was something I definitely remember. What do you take away from a game like this where pretty much everything is working for you guys? Mm -hmm. How much can you really gauge where you're at now? I think overall we take away that if you know we just trust what the coaches are just giving to us and the overall preparation is continue to do what we do. You know, that's the biggest thing that I took away from this game. This preparation has to be there. There's a lot of talking obviously just feeling more comfortable. Do you think this defense as a whole feels more comfortable understanding what the coaches are asking you guys? Most definitely. I think anytime you have two years in the system of any system you're gonna feel more comfortable just being around people, you know. You know, Billy Bowman or Justin Harrington feels more comfortable talking to me than they did last year. so I think stuff like that helps as well. Some big hits from the defensive backs today. Is that something that you guys have put a, a big emphasis on or just work out that way? I think obviously we want to be an aggressive defense, so that's just not the linebackers, it's in the D line. That's, that's everybody. I think that's the mentality that starts with you know, everybody. I think that shows it up. Does it help the overall energy when you get a day like today and get a bunch of guys that get snaps and you all kind of get the opportunity to root for each other? Yeah, I think that's an amazing thing. You know, I think what they said 87 people played today. Like, that's amazing. You know, and we all practice, you know, so I think everybody getting an opportunity to play is just awesome and I'm glad to be a part of it. A little extra juice just to get the shot out, get the zero up there. I imagine that kind of give a little extra pep in everybody's step. I think, you know, just the overall performance of how we played today gave us that juice. And I think we're all excited for next week. But, you know, we're going to enjoy this one today and move on tomorrow. Did you get pretty still for Kanai when he made that? Oh, straight? yeah. <laughs> no, I was excited. Definitely, you know, first turnover of the year, you know, being from our room. And that's an emphasis for Coach um, for Coach Kalai, and that was just amazing. Yep. Hey, did you expect Gentry to play like he did today to come out and have the kind of game you had i think the overall preparation you know coach Villar, you know put that in my head that you know you have to think that you're gonna make the plays not think that you're gonna mess up so overall i just trusted what he said today gentry right how you doing garen yes, sir. Class yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. gotta forget her over the face <laughs> fellow horns stick together yo. yes sir uh hey first of all um did you expect it to be, i don't know if anyone expects 73 to nothing right mm -hmm. like, could you feel that you had the potential for something like that if you guys had your had your stuff together? We're prepared really hard. You know, I think when you do that, you have a really good chance to do what you did like today. You know, I think the preparation really helped us, and we, that's something we've got to continue out through the season. If you nip, like, where do you start? If you have one thing like I got to get better at here, starting tomorrow, what's going to be? For me, I think it's just overall, you know, fitting gaps and seeing things a little bit sooner. You know, I think I did a okay <laughs> job, but obviously to be an elite player, I got to do it at a high level. What do you think? Then fair enough. I'll ask the opposite of that. What are you most pleased with about how you played today, specifically? Um, overall, I think I'm just pleased with how the team did, you know, as okay. a unit. You know, I, I haven't really looked at myself in the mirror and see what I did wrong or right, but I know. Yeah. I think we played really well as a team. You know, we got something to build off of. We're ready for the next week. It didn't seem like, you know, super flashy, but it seemed like you guys were just, you know, kind of making the right play all game long. Is that... Kind of what you thought too? Yeah, it's supposed to be routine plays, you know. That's what we call it around here, you know. We want to be able to play at a high level for a long time, and that's stuff we got to do. Seeing the zero on the scoreboard, I mean, just, you know, what's that feeling like? It's an amazing feeling, actually. And uh, seeing 73 next to it, <laughs> that helps as well, too. <laughs> but, no, I think we all played great today, you know. And we got some stuff to you know, get better at. But overall, I think it was a really good day for us. Hey, some other guys in the secondary stand out for you today? Um, I saw Peyton Bowen had a big hit. You know, that was really nice to see like that. Woody Washington did what Woody does every week. Um, Can I walk with the strip? Um, Jacoby Johnson got in there and made some plays. I think overall, that was a really good day for the unit. You mentioned